part of our springtime activity kits with the Cradle to Crayon Coalition are snails. We have two different ones, one for the little kids, one for the big kids. So first I'm going to show you how to make your little snail in the little kid kit. Now you're going to get one smaller piece of paper with a even smaller piece of paper. And you're going to need a pair of scissors. We're going to take the small piece of paper, cut it down the middle, nice and long. Now this is going to be the body of the snail and this is going to be the antennas of the snail. We're going to take our glue put a little glue down on the end to make our antennas. Two. Now this is the inside of the body of the snail. Now you're going to take your marker we're going to roll the snail up around the marker like so to get up to his antennas. Let it go. Gives you your nice little curl. He's a little bit thick, so we're gonna, I'm gonna do it one more time with my fingers. There we go. And then we're gonna give him some eyes. Always oh, got super long antennas. I think I'm gonna trim mine down just a little bit. And I'm going to take two googly eyes. And put them on. That gives us a cute little snail. Maybe you have another piece of paper. You can make a little, some ground or a leaf for him. And you can glue him to the leaf if you want. And he's a cute little snail. You can decorate him in the little mouth. Put some freckles on him. There we go. There's my snail. Now, our second snail is a little bit harder. You're going to get a piece of construction paper that has an outline of a snail. I've already pre colored them. And I'm going to put some big googly eyes on them as well. There we go. If you don't have googly eyes, you can just draw his eyes on. I'm going to give him a little mouth as well. Okay, what we're going to do is we are going to make a twirly paper on his shell. So we're going to get lots of different colors of paper, all sorts of sizes. And we're going to cut thin strips. Now you can make them as thin or as thick as you want and keep them fairly thin. And you're also going to have a little stick. We're going to do the same idea that we did with the pencil not the other one and we're going to make a twirl on it. We're going to take our piece of paper and twirl it around the stick. Nice and tight. Twirl. And we're going to let it go. Got one. If you think it's too tight, you can give it a little twirl, make it looser or bigger, depending on how you want it. And you're going to make a whole bunch of these. And once you've got a whole bunch of them, in all different colors, different kinds of paper, we are going to take our glue. I'm going to use white glue. And spread it all over our shell. Let's do a few for now. on the shell. So I'm going to continue to make some more twirlies and finish up my snail.
Now you may want to make all of your twirls first before you glue them down. Um, it is easier to use the white glue. Do a little press and then let it dry. And then once it's dried, if you want, you can cut your snail out or you can just leave him on his card. I hope you enjoyed this craft and I also hope you enjoyed your other one.